Hey everyone, happy Memorial Day weekend. I am, <clears throat> I'm uh, driving, it's not focusing very well, there we go. Timber and I are driving um, out to Vassalboro, it's about, I don't know, 35, 40 minutes. Um, I haven't done a video in a week or so. We've been really, I was waiting on the rain um, or things to dry up a little before we started working. I think I kind of explained that in the last video. And then Wes came out and we, there was a crack in the extended boom cylinder in the um, forwarder. So I decided I was gonna, um, I was gonna just put a weld over the crack, which I, it was only like maybe that long. And the older John had to slap younger John way of thinking so because the crack's still there and it probably would have come through again and it would have been during some time when I really wouldn't have wanted it to happen so I decided to take it out which was good because there ended up being more issues with the cylinder which with the extended boom it's got there I'll show you in a little bit if I'm having there's pucks little bronze pucks there's two on each side of the boom they're about that big they screw in and they kind of keep the boom tight and aligned well those were worn out and it was allowing the the cylinder the there's like a, a part of, on the barrel at the end where the hydraulic line screws into that was wearing and it wore so thin that it that was probably going to be an issue too also the the packing on the end of the barrel was was unspinning or was coming out so if I hadn't taken it out there was three potential issues so but it just took a lot longer than expected to get the cylinder fixed um, and those little bronze pucks they were hundred and fifty dollars a piece at Caterpillar and it, so it would have been six hundred bucks which is ridiculous um, so I brought, I, I had one, I brought it out to the machine shop where I had the cylinder fixed and I don't know the exact price yet, but he thought he'd be able to do it for 70 bucks a piece. So about half price. So I had to make eight, um, and a little cheaper the more you have and then I have extra. So right Timber? He's tired. Timber. Timber. What's going on? So, I'll come back in a little bit and uh, show you at least the cylinder. I know that's done. Um, I didn't want to wait till Monday to go out and get the cylinder. I just want to get it, or Tuesday, I guess. I just want to get that on, and then if i got to run out here again and get the pucks, that's okay. So, I'll be back. Hey, well, I'm back. Um, I didn't get any video at the shop there. Um, I thought Don was going to be fishing, and he probably wouldn't want to be on video, so um, I brought the little plate and that other brass um, uh, bronze puck out so he could um, drill and tap the two holes that you put on after you've installed the puck. So I don't know if I, I probably should have listened to the other video that I took, but if I didn't mention it. That's why I brought those pucks out there because he could make them for about half the price that um, I could buy them at Caterpillar. So, and I had kind of the time while it was getting worked on the cylinder there, so I wasn't going to worry about it. So, and I kept, I think I kept the extra one, so I'm having eight made, but I'll have nine. So, next time I need to get some made, um, I will just uh, bring one out way in advance. That way I'm not waiting for them and be ready to go. So hopefully he'll be done those pretty shortly. So I don't know if it's not it poured um, back, back at home. It seems like we got an inch of rain in about half an hour. So, so much for things drying out. But anyways, um, figured I'd just come back. I wanted to get some video at the shop, but I didn't want on to feel all awkward so 
wicked nice guy. And he's a he's super talented um, Frenchman, but uh, the finest kind. Super hard working, does a great job. That guy, um, he can fix anything and it won't ever break again. Super talented. So sometimes it might take a few more days to get um, what you want done, mostly because he's just he doesn't say no to work. And um, like the cylinder, he just ran into a couple other things, which I understand. So, but most of the time, it's worth waiting for because he's really good. So, anyways, like, subscribe, comment, and we'll catch you later.